Hey guys, Matt Jung with 88HVAC here today. I'm going to be going over a ZBC 404 control board and how to hook up a Nest thermostat to this bad boy. So what we got going on is we have a radiant heating system and I actually have here, sorry for the mess, um, a four zone control board and I'm in the middle of testing it right now. And as you can see, I have two zones right now that are hooked up and calling for heating. Now, what's the difference here of a thermostat that I'm hooking up? I'm actually hooking up Nest thermostats to this. So what I'm typically doing is I'm taking a power, I'm taking a neutral, and I'm taking a W heat call. Um, back from the thermostat and as you can see here I set it up where from a nest I have my heat call I have my red or my power 24 volts but then I came over and I wire netted together my common and boom I found it on this lug here on the top and how I most definitely found out how and where I'm getting 24 volts from is from this meter here. So I double checked it by placing one of my meter ends to where this red is and apologize for the one handed demonstration here. My other one here to my lead and it showed me that I got my 24 volts. So this is where my nest is going to be picking up the power um, off this ZBC because I have a nice 24 volt power supply here. And um, after I find out where my power was coming from, and I just ran it back to my nest. And uh, once you get that going, then on the bottom what we have here is we have lugs for 24 volts for your zone actuators and right here is your end switch and what this is it's typically a switch in your motor in your zone actuator that once it fully opens um, it switches everything in the ZVC to open up um, your relays here and your end switch okay so um, the point of this um, little video here is how to hook up your nest to a ZBC and again you would do your W your red to your nest or your power and then you would come back and land your common to the top lug of this um, transfer, transformer input to the board so um, be careful you don't want to be touching um, anything the metal you'll short out and blow out that fuse right there in the middle but um if you got any questions um you can always give us a call or check out more videos on youtube all right so now i got to go back to work and figure out how to wire in three more zones upstairs to my nest and uh, we'll be good to go and if you're wondering why I have jumpers in the bottom of these units, it's because I'm using just motor actuators with no end switches. So I actually need to jump out the end switch so my other relays on this board activate for my end switch to my boiler. So anyway, any questions, you can always uh, go back to the schematic here. It's a very good schematic um, to follow. You can get this online. If you just type in schematics to a zone control on the Takeos, um, Upinor puts out an, another nice little board and um, more compact, but you're going to have to add a transformer and, uh, and that's about it. All right, good luck.